So here's the definition of velocity banking. I crafted this myself, just observing the marketplace, okay? What it is. Has anyone ever heard of velocity banking before? Raise your hand if you're familiar, practicing, only a few hands, okay? And raise your hand if you have no idea what velocity banking is, first time you're hearing that word. Awesome, that makes sense because velocity banking, understand this is just a marketing term. Don't get caught up on the word, it's just marketing. Just referring to the speed or direction that something is going in. I'm looking to increase your velocity of money, the flow, the flow, right? That's the goal. Banking is referring to how you operate your finances. Every one of us uses a bank. So I'm looking to improve how you bank in the marketplace today. This strategy comes from another country. Australia is, when, is where it started. So you put that in your notes. Australia is where Velocity Banking came from. In Australia, they don't do 30-year mortgages. They pay their mortgages off in like 10 years or less because they are using this concept to do that, <laughs> along with many of their other debts. They have certain types of banking systems in their country that help them do this, which we have in the United States. But the banks are not teaching you this, okay? It is not exactly profitable for most banks to sit down and teach you this concept. It is complex. There's some, you know, there's a, a lot of steps involved in this, but when executed properly, the results are phenomenal, right? In terms of either using the concept to pay off debt or using the concept to actually generate more income. So you can do both. You can do both at the same time or you can do one at a time. Very unique. So it's the ability to leverage other people's money. OPM. If we're going to get access to the wealth and we're already starting at so low, we're already in last place. Can't go no lower. We're in last place, second to last place. To me, that's an opportunity. Yeah, it is an opportunity. To me, that's an opportunity. Can you imagine in the next 10, 15 years we jump five ranks? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa. You can't go nowhere but up. Yeah. When you in last, you can't go nowhere but up. When you failed so many times, you can't go nowhere but forward. You done failed all the times you were supposed to fail. My goodness. So the ability to leverage other people's money via a line of credit. These are terms I want you to write down if you've never heard them before. These are terms in the banking system that is gonna help you leverage your position to jump certain levels, all while being good stewards and managers of his resources, okay? So it's the ability to, ability to leverage a line of credit, a credit card, okay? Personal line of credit or business line of credit, a HELOC, home equity line of credit. Write that down if you don't know what that is. So we have PLOC, stands for personal line of credit, right? CC, credit card, BLOC, stands for business line of credit for those of you who have businesses. You can obtain this on your business. And then if those of you who are homeowners, raise your hand, homeowners. Homeowners, you got mortgages, cool. Depending on the amount of equity that's in your property, you can obtain one of these tools, a home equity line of credit. These tools can be used to rapidly pay off debt, right? By canceling interest on your debts faster than traditional ways of paying off debt by using your own income and cash flow, right? Pretty interesting.